Jordan was mentioning as far as, you know, adjustments to the collegiate game is learning what not to do <laughs> as far as what Coach Huggins want, wants. How's that transition going for you? I think it's working well for me. Um, I do. I just try to do what he don't like, but he doesn't like to see. I don't do it. And, you know, it's, it's helping a lot of us. You know, sometimes, sometimes you have to dribble to create a shot, sure. but shorten your dribble to, to get an open man. And, you know, when you do that, you get a lot less open for a three. You know. <laughs> but, <laughs> but it's helping a lot. So is there a little bit of an adjustment period as, you oh. know, some of the new guys coming in kind of figuring out, you know, what, what you can and what you can't do? With Definitely. You know, we got guys like Derek Culver and Andrew Gordon who in high school probably got the ball in the post and bullied whoever was behind them. You got me. I kind of did everything in high school. You got Jordan who did everything in high school. And Trey did everything in high school. Jermaine's been doing everything for a long time. You know, us getting adjusted to, you know, now we have to be in a role and then maybe blossom into something. You know, it's, it's definitely a big adjustment, but I think we're doing it well. And we don't have really any egos right now where everybody's kind of just accepting the job because we all want to play. And if you don't accept what your role is, then you're going to sit on the bench. And that's what Huggies harps on us a lot it's every day. Just do what you do. Coach Huggins said last week that you are very coachable. What does that mean to you? Just listen. I mean, Huggs is hands down one of the best coaches ever. And you can't really compare. You get the numbers, you get whatever you want. He's one of the best coaches ever. And so when he's telling me something, I really have no option but to listen. He's been around this game longer than I've been alive. So learning from him. It's helped me a lot, and now on the court, I'm seeing things that I didn't see before when I, before I got here. You know, seeing an open man, catch, turn, look, triple threat, always. You know, he he teaches us a lot, and it's a lot of fundamental stuff. You know, you don't think about fundamental stuff at this level because you, you, know, you think that you already have it, but really here, it's te it's so technical at this level. Every little thing matters, and you know, we you can make little mistakes, and it, it'll cost you big time. You know, it costs a run for the other team, and. You know, I always just try to listen to him, and that's kind of been my thing just my whole life is trying to listen and take take from people that I can. But I was just kind of giving me like an unlimited supply of material that I can use on court. And I'm, he can just give me as much as you want. You know, and I see my dad. You know, my dad was kind of my coach my whole life, and. I just always try to listen to him because I know that for where I wanted to go, where I want to go, he he knows. And that kind of just translated into high school and here, and it's working so.